in Cap 21, I I was still one of the top people. So Wait, I wasn't Cap 21. What is this? That's again? the musical theater studio. Okay. Within Tish. Okay. Got um, it. there's like 60 people that are let in per year. Also, I was one of those 60 with Lady Gaga. We were the two people that dropped out Wait, at the no same way. time. So you were, wait, you were, a, you were like in class with Lady yes. Gaga? Bachelor in Paradise alum Carly Waddell is spilling the tea about her college experience with Lady Gaga. The 38-year-old former reality star opened up to Bachelorette alum Jason Tartik on the November 6th episode of his podcast, Trading Secrets. And she revealed what it was like being at NYU's prestigious Tisch School of the Arts with the pop icon whose real name is Stephanie Germanata. You were like in class with Lady yes. Gaga? Like you yeah. know Lady Gaga? Well, I, yes, but then she was Stephanie. Okay, what was Stephanie like in class? I, what, I was not a fan. No way! <laughs> this is why. Because, I mean, she was so talented. But I have a... Okay, so like... Let it out, Carly. This is... Okay, some tension here we go. There. Trading secrets. Here we go. Here's a secret. So Stephanie used to... During lunch, she would play on the piano. There's a piano because you would eat just in like a dance studio. Yeah. And um, there was a piano and she would sit at the piano every single day and just play and sing Wicked at the top of her lungs every day. Okay. And we were all just trying to eat lunch. It was like break time. Yeah, it was break time. <laughs> and we were all like forced to listen to her. And yes, was she good? Of course. She yeah. was great. But yeah. I just wanted to eat my sandwich, you know? Interesting. And so I used to just eat in the hallway. Did Because everyone... she was driving me crazy. Carly went on to note that even back then, Gaga marched to her own beat when it came to fashion too, noting that the now superstar was already sporting wild looks only she could pull off. So extra. Like She's so extra. Always putting in the extra hour, always like yeah. something. Like that's how she Stephanie She would wear these was. really tight leotards and she had really big boobs back then. And, and her boobs are just like coming out. Lady Gaga has yet to respond to Carly's comments as of November 8th, but the former Bachelor contestant also shared how she was so impressed by the singer's talent and how she really shined when it came to making her own music. Was she oh. noticeably in <laughs> your... <laughs> so was ridiculous. she like noticeably though, like way better than everybody? Like No. She wasn't like Wayne Gretzky to hockey, LeBron no. to basketball. She wasn't in that group, that person? No, I wouldn't say. I mean, she was... She was one of the good ones, but yeah. I I would never be like she was the so above. Interesting. But now she's what? so above. All right, so then <laughs> let, all right, and I'll I'll get off this in a second. I'm just so intrigued. Why? How do you think someone who was, let's just say, in like the top ten percent, because you have to be in the top ten percent to be in this group, then go to the maybe the best ever in the world? What do you think she had done between your time? in studying with her versus where she is today. Like, how do you make that? Gosh, joke? I don't know. I mean, she started, you know, doing her own music way before she was doing musical theater stuff. And when she played at the, um, like talent show, the NYU talent show, yeah. she was singing her own stuff. And it was, I was like, you can't, I mean, you can't argue that girl's really good. Yeah. And I would, I would definitely say she was better. She was good at everything, but she was better at her own stuff. She okay. was down at the piano, like wailing her own tunes. Okay. Now I'm like, God, what was she singing? I yeah, wish I could remember. Right? Or had a video of it or something. <laughs> She's like, ah, no, no, no. <laughs> Although Carly wasn't exactly an early Gaga fan, she has major respect for the A-lister's choice to bow out of Tish and pursue her own career. I don't know. I mean, I don't know what she did, but she's a genius. All right. Well, Carly is a fan of her music, a fan of her talent, maybe not a fan of I her personally. I wasn't her fan of her at that moment. At that moment. You know, yeah. but I was not my best at that moment either. I think sure. we both dropped out of the program because we didn't love the program. And sure. I'm sure she was just as unhappy in it as I was, or yeah. she would have stayed. So Have you ever talked to her since? No. Okay. No. All right. No. So, but you, I remember sitting and we both had to like go to the, you know, the president's office or whatever yeah. to like talk about dropping out or whatever. And we were sitting there together and she's like, So what's your deal? And I was like, I just, it's not, it's not a program for me. Yeah. She's like, Yeah, no, me either. Terrible. Interesting. Like, yeah, I, don't know. I would make it, I would make the bet she knows who you are. Like she remembers you. Cause I, I can remember like kindergarten. I remember yeah. every person. Like yeah. Lady Gaga knows Carly, period. Yeah. And I feel like she's really smart. So why would you? Maybe you should like reconnect with her. Well, do, you, do your next single. <laughs> My <laughs> Take, next single is with Lady Gaga. Like, yeah, I just go straight not? to the top. Could you imagine? That'd be amazing. <laughs> <laughs>